By default, Slickedit's configuration goes into the My Slickedit Config directory in the Documents folder on Windows, and in the .slickedit directory in the User's Home directory on Unix platforms. On the Mac, the configuration directory is in the Application Support slash Slickedit directory under the User's Home directory by default. There may be a reason you want to specify a different directory for your configuration, or you may want to have more than one configuration to launch the editor with a certain workspace open or some other reason. Whatever the reason, this can be achieved by running Slickedit with the dash SC command line option, followed by a path name. If the path specified does not exist, it will be created. Let's try this out. From a console, we'll run Slickedit by simply running VS. Slickedit has to be in our path, of course, and it will bring up the editor with our existing configuration from the My Slickedit config directory. The most obvious configuration change here from the default is that we are using a dark color scheme. Now we'll close Slickedit and run it with a dash SC option and a path to specify an alternate configuration directory. When we run VS dash SC my config, the most obvious configuration difference is that the colors are different, but it's also using a different workspace. Running the command this way would work for Unix platforms, but on Mac, you would have to run open dash A slick edit pro 2018.app dash dash args dash SC and then the config path. Download your free trial today. Go to www.slickedit.com slash trial.